Hello, uh, Jim Howard here in Fort Worth, Texas. Today's date, it's uh, April 26 of 2018. You don't have to worry about this being too long. We've got lasagna cooking, so and it'll be done before long, and I'm going to want to get some lasagna. Here's a desk stand, by the way, plastic, that I got to hang your headphones on. It doesn't work out very well. It's kind of, you know, not... It was stainless steel or titanium. By the way, this is, the camera being used right now, is my Panasonic G7. And uh, that device I told you about, the, uh, let's see, Amazon, where are you? Uh, orders. Da, 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 da. Here it is. It works. It's working now. Uh, I had to order in. I didn't know. I didn't know what I could have looked up on the thing, but for the camera, uh, on their site they list cameras that uh, do work with it. Uh, for Panasonic, I think there was only three or four the g7 luckily for me was one of them and the other two were even more expensive than the g7 and i didn't pay any attention to the rest of the uh but anyway when i first got it i did not have a i have a ton of cables <laughs> i have all my life not just cables but everything i'll have something and then I can't find it when I need it. So back in the old days, I'd go to Radio Shack. And so I'd end up with a closet full of things because then I would find later the other item. But I did not have a, I thought I did. So then I had to order uh, a mini. I don't know whether I got a mini or a mic. Well, I don't know. I got one of each in order to make sure I had the right one. And... Gold-plated high-speed HDMI to... God, it's terrible to get old. People should get... After working all your life, you get old, you get out of the... Uh, Gold-plated high-speed micro HDMI to HDMI cable. that tell 10 foot long, which looks like about the right length. The other one I got was 10 foot long too, but it wouldn't fit uh, wouldn't fit that camera. So uh, I don't know if I have those on the desktop here. Uh, yesterday or whatever I got it, got the cable, got it plugged in. And, whoops, oh, man, that, that'll give me a headache before long. Uh, magnifier glasses. Um, So, I had the uh, camera too close. That I, I do not look good in close-ups. I especially do not look good at uh, <laughs> with a good quality camera. Although my uh, Logitech USB cameras here, they they both have, uh, do uh, do very well. USB, and in fact, I'm thinking that. Uh, the picking up a little bit on the light here. That's why it's not very good. Uh, there we go. It's better. I'm blocking. Uh, and then the other, that's the Bro, which I think it's, a, it's 120, 60 or something like that. It's USB, but it's a uh, Logitech, but it's expensive. And the C930E is also a good camera, but I think it's $100 or less, both USB cameras. But I wanted to try out a, you know, digital uh, camera, whatever, and we see that this works. Uh, but I made, and see if they're on the desktop here, I'll um, show them to you. 
Okay, I don't think they're on the desktop. I don't, don't remember. I'll stick them on the end of this video. Um, now, I haven't set it up yet, but by uh, Wi-Fi, or is it Bluetooth? Can't remember now. I also, there's an application that I can put on my computer, on my cell phone, on my cell phone to control the camera. So I could be, now I don't have, a, I think I, that's a 40 millimeter lens, fixed lens or whatever. Uh, maybe it's 40 to 42 or something. If I had like the, what, 150 uh, on there, then I could, I don't have a one, if I, Bought another lens, then I could zoom in and out. And, but with this, I could, with the remote, I could uh, be sitting here talking to you and uh, changing the settings. Uh, so, so anyway, that works. But I'm not sure because, well, when you see the videos, even this, uh, wait a minute, that's too, uh, that's too much of Jim Howard. Um, Like I said, I want to keep this short. Uh, I, of course, probably like most, I'm using Amazon Prime, and I love it. I love the, you know, uh, the shipping, same-day shipping, uh, free shipping, everything. And I, I don't watch uh, much of Amazon uh, videos or shows, but I do occasionally, but and the main thing for me is the uh, prime, the shipping. And but anyway, they have a whole bunch of benefits, and it's uh, been ninety nine per year. And I paid ninety nine a year for I don't know how many since they started, I guess, from the very beginning when they started it. And then last year, well, within the last year, I <clears throat> when it came due, the hundred dollars or whatever, I like I am often, I thought, oh, I, I really don't want to spend that money this month. Uh, you know, I'm kind of short. And so I just went for the monthly plan. But anyway, they're raising the price May 11th, I think it is. Yeah, May 11th, the change will go into effect and will uh, apply to renewals beginning June 16th. Um, says here the price was originally $79. I remember that. Uh, you can read. I put a link to it. Or you can just do a, a search. Uh, it's a 20% increase. I think that's... Uh, I think that's a big increase. But I think it's, wor you know, it's worth it at $119 a month. But a 20% increase is a, is a big increase. Uh, I wish what, what they would do is, uh, say, make it $125 increase, but 90, keep it $99 if you pay for a year in advance. But I don't know. They have to look at their numbers and see, but I wish they'd do it. So in other words, I, I would go back to the yearly plan and, happily pay $100, but I'll pay $119 uh, uh, for the service, you know, also. Um, my, uh, let's see, back to, anyway, this device does work for me. It's a USB at one end, so and it's 3.0. They want three, that you know, 3.0, and I have a 3.0, and then the HDMI cable, a regular size, whatever that, you know, goes there, and then it goes over to plug into the camera in this case. Now, you could do some other things with this. Uh, you could uh, you could run uh, Xbox or something. I'm, I'm not sure, you know, don't hold me to that. But you could run other things, HDMI into that, display them on the... Uh, on the screen and uh, oh I'm on this camera over here um, so you could uh, 
you can do that. You can do a lot. I haven't got into that. I haven't uh, got into that. I'm not sure about this. I could see where this would be good. Uh, a lot of times you see me try to show you something and, uh, you know, hold it up to whatever. And that would be good. But so far as uh, portrait style for me, it's not good. You know what, man, I'm really stupid. <laughs> I have a bunch of tripods here. Uh, a while back, I ordered a, uh, a little better tripod. And it came looking like, a tri you know, with a, like this. Uh, and then I saw that you could replace the head on it, uh, or I thought you could, with, uh, what do they call it? Anyway, a very smooth ball, a ball, not a ball joint. I forget what they call it now. And when uh, this one tripod, which, here, let me see if I can, this tripod here, for the other camera, for the USB Logitech, when I, I go and try to uh, move, you know, I don't know if you can see it, you know, the, the stand is moving. I don't know that one. Uh, so I thought I'd get something better. Well, I got the tripod and wasn't all that great. So I ordered, this isn't it. I ordered a, uh, I thought I could upgrade the, uh, whatever this part is called. And uh, it wouldn't fit, you know, it wouldn't fit. It didn't have the right size bolt and you need this and that. So I just put that away. <laughs> And then the other, yesterday or a day or two ago or whatever, I ordered in a much better tripod. Well, only not a lot of money, $70 tripod. And I'm, that's what I'm using now. Well, let's take a look at it. Amazon orders. Here it is. Now you see it doesn't have the, the handle at the top or whatever. But the same company makes a, what do they call that? Well, I'll just have to see. Because I ordered it. Uh, orders. So they make this, the very same company. And so it, I could take, I could take that off and put this on top of it. And it is, you know, really smooth operating and of course all adjustable and whatever. So I ordered this, and I guess I need to go to engineering school or uh, something because I can't figure out how in the world to get it on there. Something to do with not having the right size bolt. You would think it would come with the bolt with it and then with another size for, but uh, probably down here they tell, yeah, looky here. So, Six ninety nine and seven ninety seven. Guess I need to order those parts. So uh, my son today got a Amazon Echo Echo Ten. Ten inch is a good size. Um, hmm, I don't know that. Did they just lower the price down? 32, 64. I think they just lowered the, what the heck did I, altogether with shipping and tax and everything, I paid 230 bucks for it or something. Oh, please, I don't even want to look at this. That's what the, I don't, <laughs> I'm glad they lowered the price, but okay. Well, I don't even want to see that. If that, if that's the case, I have to go back later and figure out. But uh, 
let me, I, like I said, I'm going to tack on the end of this video if I can find them. The, and I think there's even a, bit, a video, a couple of little video clips of me using this camera with this uh, device that I got, the link, cam link or whatever. And you can see uh, it's not accurate because I look gross and I am a handsome person. So uh, that's an attempt at humor. I tell you, I don't know what's going on with the world. And you have to tell people now, I'm just kidding, I'm just joking. Anyway, I'll include those lip, uh, lips, clips, if I can find them. Um, so I told you about the Amazon price increase. Let me tell you about my day today. I went to my doctor. I hadn't been in quite a, about a, almost a year. I did. I needed to go for my, he wants me like every six months or something. And I didn't go because I didn't want to catch the flu. It was so bad. So anyway, I went today. They drew blood. And then he'll send me the results through the mail. But actually, I can go online and see it. And, of course, what he likes me to do is go have blood drawn and then make an appointment like a week later. I forgot to do it this time. So uh, my next appointment will be in October. Anyway, today I got the pneumonia shot. I said, is October a good time to get the flu shot? Because this time I want to get the flu shot before the flu season. He said, that'd be a very good time. Uh, he changed some of my medicines. The water pill, he is increasing to 40 milligrams. And because uh, he never he didn't, which was my, I like to take as few medications as possible. And, and I remember now telling him, eh, can we go with a lower dose, you know, so. He's increased the dose. Made some other changes. So I, anyway, I got my pneumonia shot. I'll need to get another uh, shot. And then he said, uh, he said, well, that, that'll be good for, you know, that's all you'll need. And I, well, 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 wait a minute. Uh, I mean, you could live to be 100, so might need another pneumonia shot, so. So I had the pneumonia shot. I'll get the flu shot. Uh, I didn't. He didn't offer, and I didn't get a uh, tetanus shot. I really, very rarely, you know, cut myself on something rusty or uh, do stuff. Uh, tetanus, also called lockjaw. Um, let me change cameras here. Might as well since we have the. Uh, Okay, <laughs> almost same location. Uh, everybody, you know, you, when you go to, you have a cut or something happens, or you even go to the, you know, the doctor, the emergency room, they say, uh, is your tetanus shot current? You need to get a tetanus shot. And everybody says, no, you know, and, and they give you your tetanus shot. And it's for lockjaw, and it's, that's sort of like rabies. I mean, you know, you worry about rabies, but the very few People get rabies, but you don't want to get it, you know. And uh, same with tetanus or uh, lockjaw. I actually, when I was, my parents came back, and me also, of course, my parents came back from California. They were in, Mis you know, Kansas City, Missouri. And when World War II started, they went out with me to, I was born in March of 1941. For the United States, World War II started in December of 1941. So they went out there and they both worked in the shipyards out in California, Kaiser Shipyards, building Liberty ships. And then after that, they came back to Kansas City, Missouri. And uh, then when I was five years old, or before I was five years, they uh, rented a few room, a couple rooms or whatever from a uh, seamstress. Uh, Mrs. Hannah, I don't remember her, but uh, so I was there one year, and then my parents got a house, and so then I changed, you know, schools, and uh, my mother kept in touch with uh, with her, the seamstress. She had some rumors in addition to the you know, us being there, and uh, my mother would talk to her from time to time on the phone. 
so she did her seamster stuff. <clears throat> but then later in life, uh, she was raising worms and uh, selling them for fishing purposes or I don't know, I guess that's all you could uh, sell them for, I guess. I don't know. Anyway, uh, she got sick, went to the hospital, and she died. She got lockjaw. That's the only person that I know of or ever heard of that ever got lockjaw. I guess we could all do a, so maybe somebody will do a, a search for how many cases of lockjaw, tetanus, are there any, you know, and post it in the comments. I'd be interested. And if you don't do it, I'll have to do a, a Wikipedia search myself or something. Anyway, the price of Amazon Prime going up, uh, and the lasagna should be ready about now. It's, uh, by the way, fairly dark in this, my uh, bedroom office, computer room, cell. So uh, I thank you very much for uh, watching this video. And if I can find those others, don't touch the mouse because you may see, you'll see how bad. Uh, now with this longer cord, I can, it's a 10 foot cord, so I can't go too far, but I'm not sure how far back, you know, USB 3, uh, in this case, would, would work. But I'm not sure that I'm going to be, you know, if you watch my videos, I'm always wanting this and wanting to do such and such and then I get it or, or do it or something then I'm not then I lose interest so but like I said this might be good for if I'm showing something a small object or something using the uh, Panasonic G7 camera but with it closer not good it's must be a defective camera or lens or something because it makes me look like a look like an old man. By the way, this is the not the, over there. Oh, wait a minute. Yes, it is. Which camera am I using? Oh, let's see here. Switch C nine thirty. There, okay, is the Lumex Panasonic G7. And the Logitech, is that, how do you pronounce that? Bro, bree, bro, I, I don't know. And then this is uh, that, so. Thank you very much for watching. Don't touch the mouse in case I can find those others videos. Okay, do we have the, no, we don't have the sound, you know, we do have the sound going, I believe. I'm using the Panasonic G7 camera, and it's uh, hooked into... The device, Let's see it orders. It's hooked into this device. This is plugged into the USB, and I have an HDM regular. I have a cord, I, I just received it today, two of them. I didn't know which size to get, so I got one of each type of... So this goes from this HDMI over to the little, I'm not sure if it's called a micro or mini. It goes into the HDMI on my Panasonic G7. And uh, on the G7, I, I purchased it with a stock lens that is what uh, 50 42 I think it's I think it's 42 
millimeter lens. Uh, so I don't have, this is great for portraits, but, well, I mean, it's not, uh, look. Uh, too close, I mean, uh, this is on the tabletop on a small, whoops. Still too, too much detail and too close. Guess that's what I'll I'll try here next. So I'm going to stop here. I guess I should tell you, Jim Howard in Fort Worth, Texas. Today's April 25th of 2018, and the camera, of course, is is the Panasonic G7. I have three cam well, counting that. So there are three cameras that are. Uh, 